Here's a little street rod pickup time, 1956 GMC 100. So we have a half ton regular cab here. That's what the 100 series stood for. This particular one, Pontiac Michigan built truck. Obviously modified quite a bit since it would have came from General Motors back in 1956. This particular truck is powered by a small block Chevy 350 V8 underneath the hood. Also nicely equipped with power steering, power brakes, AC. Did try the AC a little while ago. It does blow cold. Compressor turned on and off. And I'll show you where the controllers for that are on the interior. And it also has an overdrive transmission. Automatic with overdrive. 700 R4. So nice setup for going down the road with this vehicle. Now if you want to check out the still picture. So you can see the engine bay. Check out the interior. Underside. The bed of it. Check out the still pictures at uniqueclassiccars.com. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it. It's going to take you right there. Of course, you can call us to 507-386-1726. Kind of just a nice, true orange color. Of course, that, I believe, 56 was the one year only of that grill style right there. Kind of done the monochromatic look to it with the whole orange. Riding on radial tires, chrome wheels. Does have front disc brakes, rear drums along with those power brakes and we'll pop the hood and I'm going to show you that engine bay here in a little bit check that out interior is kind of a call it not really a camel but maybe almost a cream a little darker cream looks very nice there's touch-up paint for the interior behind the seat there's also the orange paint that comes with it aftermarket stereo put in there um, customized dash a little bit but yet somewhat kept that original look to the dash too so I'll show you when we get around to the driver's side, check that out. Now remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with the transportation and this truck may be eligible for an extended service contract. So consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. Town will cover. And that just lifts up like a modern town will cover. The rolled pan in the back with the French in tail lights. When I start it up, maybe I'll pop that up so you can see the rear of it too. Kind of a flat black matte finish spray in. Not really a bad bed liner, but kind of a flat finish in the bed portion of it. And again, you can see that in the still pictures. Check them out. UniqueClassicCars.com. Easiest way to do it. Click on the link down below in the description of this video. Going to take you right there. Uh, some of the service work that was recently done to this too. It has a new battery. Brakes were good. All over 50% between... 15 and 30 percent of the brakes fuel fuel system was cleaned and flushed rebuilt carb new cap rotors and wires and this thing will fire right up every time i've moved this truck or moved it around our showroom it uh, will fire right up so let's go check this interior out we're going to start it up see what we have in here so door panels obviously done painted to match the original vin plate and everything in the door jam you can see some vents were added here for the ac tilt column and again automatic transmission with overdrive but yet kept that the old style GMC looking dash and gauges then went ahead we did a nicer headliner in it nicer seat vinyl seats are in nice shape stereo control as well as the manual right there let's go ahead and start this up I'm gonna go show you how easy this starts Baby's always fired over, like I said, anytime I've wanted to move it. All right, custom stereo system. Now, as far as AC, here's the fan for the inside, for the blower. That turns your compressor on and off. Red light will come on blowing cold right now so yes it does blow cold getting kind of that old cool 56 GMC gauge style cluster very smooth running small block door closes nicely slip around to the back no crazy exhaust nothing over the top there 
FYI, in some of these videos and the pictures, this almost comes off a little more red. It is really a true kind of orange. Sometimes the lighting makes it a little bit tough, but uh, I'll get around to the front here a second. I want to pop this hood, and uh, I want to show you this engine bay. So give me a second to get that open, and let's we'll check out that engine bay. All right, hood pop. Just trying to see if I could get that orange to kind of stand out the way it is. It just gets a little darker, a little red in the video, it seems like, than it truly is. All right, small block Chev. Smooth that runs. AC compressor there. Of course, I switched that switch back off so it's not engaged. Power brakes, and again, front disc. There's some nice polished aluminum dress up here. Power steering. And of course that 700R4 automatic transmission with overdrive, so this thing should be set up to go down the road. All right, I want to slip around to the back. I'm going to pause this one second real quick. I want to show you how that tonneau cover works. So everything opens up back there too, just like a normal truck. All right, there we go. And like I said, you can see it's just a, a flat black kind of spray in. I wouldn't really call it a liner as it is just coloring the inside of that box. Struts work fine. So that works out very nice. That tonneau cover back there. So there you go, 1956 GMC 100 series, half ton, street rod pickup, set up nicely, power steering, power brakes, AC, small block Chev with a 700R4 automatic with overdrive. Give us a call, 507-386-1726 uniqueclassiccars.com Down below this video in the description there's a link. Click on it. It's going to take you right there. Remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. We can assist with transportation and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email.